Welcome back to my channel. This is Miss Cameroon. I am back with a new hair tutorial. So I'm gonna show you guys how I do this hairstyle. Um, I collaborated with Janet Collection. Do like a full locks um, hairstyle. So this is your new Bohemian locks. Uh, yeah, natural kinky texture. So this is new from the company. So you guys, if you wanna go check it out. Go check it out. Hope you enjoy it. I had a lot of trouble actually. It wasn't even because of the hair. It was just because of me. Um, yeah, it was just me. Not really knowing what I want to do. But yes, yes. This is my first time having full locks, by the way. So I'm excited. Do you thumbs up this video too? Um, and make sure you subscribe. Make sure you like. Make sure you share. Um, I hope you enjoyed this, and I will see you on my next video. Bye. Okay, so okay, I'm back here with my crusty, crispy hair. I'm just gonna explain what I'm doing in the video, not what you're gonna be doing. Okay, so let me just explain what I'm doing. So the first thing I'm doing is I'm going to separate my hair. This is where um basically i was gonna do like individual little crochet so that's why i was just separating everything just because i knew i was gonna do individual crochet then i'm going to just like um twist it a little bit just to like put it away you know so i can work in the back of my hair and then um focus on the front later on and guys i was watching a movie so sorry if i'm like laughing or i don't know just being annoying <laughs> So I'm gonna start in the back okay so what I'm doing here is I'm going to braid my hair in the back just do like big braids you know I'm not gonna like braid them backwards when you do crochet braids you see how like you have to braid backwards no what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna start braiding it like just I'm gonna do big braids in the back and then just sew everything down just when you sew it, make sure it is super flat. I like this method better because it's so much easier. You don't have to do too much braiding. Um, yeah, I really, really like this method. So I'm going to start doing this now every single time that I'm going to do my crochet because it takes less time to do. So yeah, definitely. So what I'm doing here is I am just going to sew my hair. I'm going to sew the hair down as flat as possible so that when i crochet it it doesn't really show i mean even if it's not that flat it's not going to show but yeah and it's so much easier because you can just crochet every single way you want here i am showing you how i braided um i'm showing you how i sew it down uh yeah how flat it's supposed to be then this is the hair um, this is the hair I got sent from Janet Collection and the hair was so nice you guys like the full the full locks were really nice they sent me six packs I believe um, and I use all six packs I feel like I needed more but I just feel like because I just ruined a lot of the the hair that's why I needed more but you don't need more than six packs but that's how the packaging look the color was 1B and it was 18 inches. I'm gonna begin crocheting the hair here. I already have a full video on how I crochet you guys. Like I already have a full video where I am just going slow and slow and I just show you how I do it step by step. But in this video I'm still gonna I'm still gonna show you guys. I am so bad at explaining so that's why I'm making it slow motion. So I'm passing in the needle in the hair or in the braid if you're braiding. Then I'm going to take the hair and I'm going to open up the little um, loop that is there. Then I'm going to put it in the hook, close the latch, then pass it through. Then open up the little hole. Then I'm going to take the other side of the hair and put it in the hole. And then just make the knot. So that's how easy it is. So 
and I'm just gonna do that all over my head all over all over all over all over Okay, I didn't show you guys what I put on my hair. I just used my Cantu butter and just put it on. So yeah, that's what I'm doing here. I'm just putting my Cantu oil on my hair. Then, guys, okay, this is where I just did not know what I was doing, okay? I was doing individual, but I should have been doing the braids way smaller because the hair, the full locks, are small they were very small than the braids I was doing so just don't even mind this I'm just showing you guys my mistake so don't do this okay in the front just do what I did if you don't know what you're doing but if you want to do this method make sure that the braids are way smaller they're the same size as um as the crochet that you're doing you know what I mean so yeah, it was too big. You guys are going to see how bad it looked. Like you can see here, I just went ahead and I started braiding it normally. And I just started crocheting it like I would normally. So yeah, that's what I did. Because it was just looking bad and nobody wants some really bad crochet braids. Never. So other than that, that's basically all. Um, in the next clip, I will show you how I decorate my hair. Um, I didn't really try to do too much, but yep, that's basically all. I finished the hair. Um, this is like the next day, by the way. Now I'm going to put like the little decorations on the hair. So I got these little pieces, the charms. So I'm just gonna go ahead and apply this on my. Hair. I don't like this one right here, so I'm gonna take that out. But let me just put this last one before I do. We okay. Now I got these little things, well there's three of them, so I'm going to go ahead and apply that, I guess you, uh... guys I don't really know how to put this on. Okay guys, thank you so much for watching my video. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Um, I will definitely see you on my next video. Make sure you subscribe, like, share, and comment. <clears throat> Sorry, my voice is cracking. <laughs> but uh, yeah, thank you so much. And um, yeah, have a great day. Bye. Yeah. Young Gerald.